Yeah, thanks. Get started this morning with Jacob Frana. Please let us know if you'd like to ask a question. Max Goldman. Are you uh, in tonight? Yeah, yeah, I'm in tonight. What are the emotions of that after so much time away? Um, you know, I haven't been playing game in almost a year. I'm trying to get to my routine, uh, my game day routine. I'm super excited, you know. Uh, that's all I can say. Just a uh, huge excitement to, to join the team again and, and uh, get back at it tonight. When did you find out that you were ready to go? Did you have a plan? Uh, well, I was training on the line yesterday. Well, if anything wasn't sure, but uh, this morning uh, I was in the lineup uh, for a pregame skate and uh, you know, I talked to uh, I talked to the coach, and then you know, talked to the doctors, and and uh, you know, I'm ready to go. What did you miss the most about playing while you were out? Uh, you know, just I think like um, haven't been able to be around the team, and you know, be doing my routine for such a long time. You know, I've been used to something for a long time, and now I've been kind of off of it, and. Uh, I think that's just the, the mental side is probably the hardest. You know, physically I feel great. Mentally I feel great now too. You know, I'm back back about uh just you know, watch a lot of hockey games <laughs> and uh being able to play is is probably the hardest. And then last thing for me, what do you what do you like about the fit next to Tyler and Hughes? Yeah, of course they are, uh, you know, they they really they're really great players, you know, they've been showing it and and you know, just gonna jump in and, and trying to uh, help the team as much as I can with my game, and and uh, I'm really excited to play with them. Yeah, Daniela Bruce. Um, obviously, you've been practicing quite a bit with your team, but how do you feel you'll adjust to gameplay tonight, an actual game? Yeah, well, it's you know, like it's my first game after a while, so I'm, you know, I hope after first shift everything go back together. But uh, yeah, I'm gonna have to watch a lot of video before a game. You know, get back to the system, get get used to the system again, and. And, uh, you know, just trying to simplify, you know, my game, just I'm, I'm feeling I don't want to, um, too much things on my, I don't want to too many things on my, uh, in my mind, you know, I just want to come here and play and my best game I can play. And um, that's what I've been focusing on since the morning now. Have you talked to any teammates that have gone through similar things like Tyler Bertuzzi was off the ice for a long time with his back surgery? Have they given you advice? Um, yeah, well, you know, it's just the, probably the, the hardest part is to, you know, be mentally strong, you know, just, you know, focus. The thing is, um, when you're a long time away from like, from your game, from from something you love, it's like um, you're starting to having little doubts in your mind, you know, you're going to stay strong mentally, you're going to be able to believe that you can come back and, you know, hold your confidence where it is. And um, yeah, yeah, I feel great today. You know, I'm been playing, I'm going to play tonight. So um, yeah, I talked to Tyler. Uh, he was saying it's it's not easy and and you know they're here for me you know, everything anytime I was you know feeling like down you know or something you know I could always talk to anybody on the team so uh, we have a great group here and uh, like I said I'm uh, really excited to join them you seem very excited good luck tonight. yeah thank you <laughs> thank you obviously excited about tonight but are there any hesitations are you a little nervous to get back into gameplay um you know that's um so good question. Actually, I you know I'm I'm a little bit nervous about just you know I haven't been playing in a while and you know, but at the same time I want to feel like it's another game for me. You know I just want to come in and that's that's uh that's another thing with don't have too much on your mind. You know just trying to come here and enjoy um, the game of hockey and and uh, you know that's that's what I'm gonna do tonight. Fans have been really into it this season and after been around for that but you haven't been on the ice for it are you excited to feed off that energy of the fans for sure i've been last year i haven't been able to uh play um i mean there was some fans on the on the uh, building but um not that many and uh you know i'm really um it's gonna be fun to, to see the, the fans in the stands and and uh, give us support awesome welcome back thank you Lee st james hi uh, when you came in last year you scored your uh, in the first game and seemed to effortlessly meld in. What do you think was, was key to you blending in so quickly? Um, you know, just, it's a good question too, actually, you know, like it's hard cause you're switching the systems and everything. And, and it's just, for me, I, I, uh, you know, focus on little things and trying to simplify my game and, and trying to fit in as best I can. And, uh, 
just do what I can do best out there. And, and uh, that was on, that was, you know, just simplize everything. And I came in and I scored first goal in the first game. On the flip side, you've been practicing uh, since January, you've been on the ice. How much do you anticipate that will help? Now you're coming back at a time when, you know, most guys have been playing 50 some games and they're, you know, in, in full, full game mode. Yeah, well, I've been training for a long time, um, pretty hard. So I'm, um, I'm in good shape uh, and I'm ready to go. I just meant that having been able to practice, how much difference that will make as far as coming back and joining the team again, uh, two thirds into the season. Yeah, I've been, I have a couple of practices with them lately. Um, but, you know, like, it's not like it's my first game ever. Like, I've, I've been playing before, uh, you know, uh, it's like I'm, I'm coming in tonight. I'm going to enjoy a game of hockey and, and uh, do my best out there. So I can tell you, actually. <laughs> Thanks. Yeah, thank you. Ted Colvin. Hey, Jacob, is this the longest you've ever been with uh, playing a game? Yeah, um, I break my tendon in my wrist uh, before. That was three months. Uh, this definitely has been the longest, um, around for five months, yeah. Um, yeah, so it's been what's, the longest. <laughs> what's the toughest part about that? I mean, do you, do you start thinking, oh, boy, is this ever going to get feel better or anything like that? Um, to be honest with you, not really. Like, we have, you know, everybody around here did a really good job around me. They've been, they helped me a lot. All the trainers, conditional coaches, everybody, you know, make me feel like I feel today. Uh, we have had a really good plan. We have stick with the rehab every single day. Um, and it feels really strong. And, uh, yeah, I feel ready to go. It's tough to be away from the team, though, because the, a lot of people always say that you don't feel you're not playing. You don't really feel like part of the team. Because uh, do you did you kind of feel that way too a little bit? Yeah, for sure. Like um, I'm, I was on a different schedule. You know, my my uh, practicing and everything was different timing, and and I, I wasn't able to be around the team while they were, were playing. I was out there watching. Uh, so yeah, it's it's probably the mental side is the hardest. Thanks, Jakub. Yeah, no problem. Thanks, everyone. Be back shortly with Coach Blaschel.